Welcome to Panda's Kitchen, where my kitchen is always dirty, yet I'm always doing something. I usually like to cook, and I usually like to eat. They kind of go together. So today, we're going to make chicken katsu. You usually see this in things like Hawaiian barbecue places, like L&L Barbecue, or Luau Hawaiian Barbecue, or places like that, or wherever it may be for you. So today, we're going to make the chicken katsu, we're going to make the sauce, and we're going to eat this stuff and make it really good. Let's check it out. Okay, so first what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your chicken breast and you are going to put some salt and pepper onto it. So we're gonna go some salt, some pepper on both sides. So we flip it over, get a little salty salty, little pepper pepper, blam! All right, after you've got that done, you're going to put it into the flour. You're gonna shake off all the excess because you don't need all that much flour. Make sure we get all the sides. Boom, look how pretty that looks. And then we're gonna take it, and you're gonna take your eggs that we beat up earlier. You're gonna dip it in there. That way, they get the basting on them. Usually let them drip for a little bit. Once you do it, finish the eggs, you're gonna put them in the panko. Make sure that it's really well coated on all sides and everything. Once you're done, you should get something like that. Boom. And you do it until you get all your pieces done. chicken katsu made we gotta go make some sauce for this thing let's go take care of that all right so to make the katsu sauce we're gonna need four things we're gonna need wash this kind of sauce we're gonna need some ketchup and we're gonna need some soy sauce and then to add a little bit of taste and flavor we're gonna need your pepper all right so you're gonna need half a cup of uh, Worcestershire sauce quarter cup of ketchup two tablespoons of soy sauce and then add a little bit of flavor add a dash of pepper and then we're just gonna mix this all together So there you have it. There's your chicken katsu with sauce. And of course, you always want to serve it over rice. I'll see you guys next week.